Hello again and welcome to my channel Mommy for Five Griffins. This is Renee and today I want to show you how to clean your oven without any chemicals. Um, as some of you may know I do clean homes for a living and this is how you would clean your home professionally especially if your client does not like chemicals. So what I do is I use a pumice stone and this stone is wonderful it does miracles and um, I'll be using this on the oven and the trick is to keep the stone wet so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spray the oven with just your basic vinegar and water and I'm going to make sure that my stone stays wet so that it doesn't scratch and it's going to get all of that baked on grime that um, a chemical would take about 15 to 20 minutes to activate the work. Well with this you don't have to wait and it doesn't leave an after smell and you're not using any chemicals that can be harmful for you. And it, it does a wonderful job. Actually, I think it's better than the chemicals. But what I'm doing now is I'm just spraying the oven with the vinegar and water mixture. And I'm going to use my pumice stone. It's going to get this glass sparkling clean. As you can see, you can see all the baked on crud. I hate to say it, but I bought this stove a little over a year ago and this is the first time I've actually cleaned the oven so yeah it's ready but let me show you how it's done you just use the stone at an angle and like I said make sure you keep your stone wet and just lightly scrub you don't even have to apply a, a lot of pressure you just lightly scrub and all of that nasty crud is going to come right off and you're just going to see the sparkling glass again. It actually works on the inside of the oven as well and I'm going to show you that in the video. But it actually takes off all of that baked on nasty crud and it, it's just wonderful. So please enjoy and uh, like always. Um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. I'd love to have you and like my video. And you can see all the dirt and the grime starting to lift up. Um, but as I said, you want to make sure to keep your pumice stone wet. And um, as long as it stays wet, it's not going to scratch anything. So that's the key and that's the secret to getting the sparkle and shine and even the dust from the pumice stone is more like a polish so um, once you have the little the little dust particles um, just clean with a microfiber cloth and it's gonna shine up um, the inside of the oven and the uh, the glass as well Here I'll show you all the nasty grime that's left over. Look at that. All of that baked on grease and food particles all lifted up really easily. And to me it actually is actually much simpler than, than using a, a chemical easy off or anything like that it, it's much easier and it's it's nothing that you can breathe in so it, it makes it a lot more healthier to to clean your oven with uh, a pumice stone and I actually use these stones for quite a bit of different things 
um, it's good in the kitchen and the bathroom on the grills that they're just they're great and now since I turned on the light in the oven for you it's much easier for you to see the inside of the oven but I'm just scouring the the back of it and I'm gonna get the sides and stuff off camera because yeah, I'm, I'm at an awkward angle right here so I'm trying to get get through this and get it done but if you enjoyed this video if I gave you some good tips please subscribe to my channel um, I'll be looking to add more tips and more things that will help you keep your home clean and keep your home healthy um, in the future and um, make sure to subscribe like and hit that bell so that you don't miss anything and of course I'm a Gemini so I'm all over the place but I do everything mommy so if, if it has to do with mommy issues or home or DIYs or or anything like that I'm in it so yeah please subscribe and keep an eye out for the next video I hope you enjoyed this video and have a good evening